Good day, friends. It is me, HL Mod Tech, and I am back with another Tinkercad designer shoutout. So let's get cracking. Friends, this one is extra special because it's one of my students. Sixth grader TT has created this awesome lizard named Popcorn that is 3D printable. Now, I watched her work on this. It was amazing. She had all of these trials as she worked through it before she finally got a final design and made one that's printable. So let's walk quickly through the notes. This was the first edition of Popcorn. If I hit F, we can zoom over here, and she notes that it was totally scrapped except for the head. If we move over here, once again, we'll use F for fit view. These are also scrapped legs, but it's so cool to be able to look back and see how you first did it. Right here, this is Popcorn 2.0, better tail. You can see that is pretty darn slick, and the body was upgraded too. Let's press F to zoom in on this version of Popcorn. This time she saved a backup of what ended up being Popcorn's final design. I love how she's got all these parts and check it out. She actually used the capsule which is what we used in Gumpo. That's pretty darn slick. Let's press F to zip over here. This time we added an open mouth and some scary teeth. That is so cool. Finally let's zip out here. <laughs> if we hit F, oh my gosh. This is where we attempted to create a bearded dragon. Those are so fun. Oh my gosh, TT, love your creativity. Let's pop over to this one. Oh my gosh, love the back. This is the spiked lizard with a tongue. Very, very cool. And then finally, let's move over here to our 3D printable designs. These are printable and they have the eye holes. If you take filament, you can push them in there to give them colored eyes. One last lizard. This is the final design. Kiddo, these are awesome. Thank you so much for your creation and taking time to share it with us. Friends, remember, if you ever make something epic like TT did, you can reach out and share it with me so easily. Simply click this button, generate a link, copy that link, and then you can share it with me. I am HL Mod Tech on Facebook, Instagram, and Gmail. You can also track me down on Twitter. I am HL Tinkercad. If those options are not available to you, don't forget you can also visit hlmodtech.com. It is my website and I have a whole tab dedicated to Tinkercad and then down at the bottom. And then down at the bottom there is a sweet built-in messaging tool. You can click that button, add your information, and shoot it to me almost instantly. While you're out here, friends, don't forget the Designer Showcase. It is the home of the Designer Directory where we house tons of awesome profiles of Tinkercad users. Friends, remember whenever you're out here, if you click on their designs, when you check out the designs like these by Zaid, oh my gosh, this is so cool. This is actually one of my tutorials and Zaid put the link in the properties. That is so fantastic. Love the design and of course, thank you for sharing. Finally, friends, I'm going to remind you, you can now click Edit Grid and turn it off so that your designs look even cooler with the awesome clear background. TT, thank you so much for sharing your design, and I'm so looking forward to turning it into a tutorial. Friends, of course, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a like. Please also hit that share button so more people can learn about HL Mod Tech. Of course, if you got a question, comment, or suggestion, add it down below. And if you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Smash that subscribe button. And last but not least, hit that notification bell if you want to be the first to know when there's a brand new video from me, HL Mod Tech. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.